Hello everyone and welcome back to the wonderful world of Slime Rancher. Friends, you as always and well. These guys are growing this. These guys are going absolutely mental. I wonder what happened to go through these. Yeah, oh god, I'm nearly dead. <laughs> Holy crap, but they are generating some fair amount of these guys, so that's not good. I need to get them some food though. These end just now. Right, let's have a little look at these guys eat again. Slimepedia, uh, slimes, what do you use eat? Veggies, all right. I mean, especially was that sort of onion thing, but it doesn't even, you probably notice I've put down a bunch more of these guys because they do take a, a 22 minutes is their actual thing. I wish that could be reduced to maybe about 15. It would be nice because then I, it could, normally what I do is like a 20 minute episode of Slime Rancher. You got a bit of a longer run because you want to explore and see what things could do and everything. This one's obviously going to see the aspect of what comes out of that. What the hell? It is growing them, but it grows carrots along with them. Okay, very odd. And basically, uh, we wanted to try and, and we'll try and fit it all in one episode, but it was never going to happen because it would be too long uh, for you guys. So a 20 minute video, 20, 25 minutes, usually what most YouTubers tend to do. From what I've found, I find that's a nice point to do things. And now it allows us to actually get things done. Let's get these guys all fed. Let's go. Can you stop trying to kill each other now? These spikes. I mean, these only have like five or four and a half minutes left now. This one over here probably has even less than that, actually. That's three minutes. Excellent. These guys has, yeah, just over four minutes. I shall see. And obviously we place some um, way out as well, so we could go around them. I'm wondering if the Black Sim can destroy them when you're not there, because that'd be a bit of annoying. But it means you can actually put turrets down throughout. Actually go in here. The World Slime Ranch. So much stuff you can do. So looking forward to digging into this a little bit more once these guys are done. So you guys kind of find it cool, like, odd like how this is like half done. Like, obviously you have this wee warehouse here, but then you get half roof. These guys are not happy, are they? Really, really not happy. Might see how many crystal ports we actually have stored in this just now. Crystal, 14 now, we need more. I was thinking we do need money as well. Okay, so what do we got? Boom ports, we don't actually have many boom ports. That's something we have to keep an eye on. I think there was like a one take break. It's two minutes left, so what we might do is I'm going to nip across because we do have a bunch of chickens we can get, and I believe the boob ports actually eat that. Let's see. You guys eat meat. Yep. Because they've not actually got much to do. They've not actually been eating at all. These guys have got, these guys have got food. We do have, to, like, well, one open pen. Uh, one of you guys did mention in a previous episode of, I think it was the last one, not the last one, but the one before, that... Slimes do need friends. You can to keep, keep them sealed off because then they won't work. Let's get all this. Excellent. Superb. Good, good, good. Give me all this. Come on. Cover up. And mangoes will be good as well. Come on. Cover up. Give it. Give it. Any more? Nope. Alright. A lot of mint mangoes there. And. A lot of. Nope, let's put them back in. A lot of elderies in there, which we don't need. We need more rooster rolls at this rate. Any of you guys? Oh, how the hell did you get out there? You get inside. Usually some hit. Why the hell are you out here? Where's the other head hens? Hello. There we go. There's. What the? Did you seriously? Yep, you did. You went over there. Okay. Ah, thank you. <laughs> when they say chickens can't fly, when they jump out of the ground, and then you have one of these. I don't know what you actually call this again. They can fly. S somewhat. Anyway, we want to go and uh, you guys, I think. Do you see mangoes? No, you don't need mangoes. 
Here you go, buddy. No, you didn't go in there. There you go, you eat them, and I'll go down here and see what we can do. Right, okay, mint mangoes. Oh, great. Oh, dear. Did not like that at all. Right, you guys as well. And then you guys eat some of these. You guys eat some of these. Some of these. There we go. Right, everybody should be all good and dandy. Where the hell is it this time? What? How the hell do you get in there, buddy? What the hell did you guys eat? I don't even know. Pick up what I need from these and this. Ow. There we go. And we'll come across here and see what else we can pick up as well. Excellent. I think the boom plorts were a bit low actually, so that'll help us out a little bit. Take care of that. And all the honey plorts as well. Go and any more rad ports over here? There definitely is. Thank you. Grab that one. We're at it. Right, that should give us enough to kind of fill up the bank. These guys should be done, I would think. Oh, doing a little dance. They're doing a little dance when they're ready. Excellent. <laughs> That's actually adorable. I'm sure, this is all nice and filled. Kinda of glad that they brought this in now and not like earlier because they obviously wouldn't have access to everything. Let's see what you get. What? 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 Honeycomb? Hexacomb? Ooh. And buzzwhack? What the hell do you use buzzwhack? Can be used to greet kind of candle if you enjoy the smell of beef abdominal glands. Alright. Ooh. I got jelly stone from it. Oh, okay, right, so they explode when you do something. Oh, okay. What the hell do you use bees buzz, buzz, buzz wax for? What the hell is buzz wax for? Uh, resources. Buzz wax. Favored uh, by not slime food. But buzz wax is a common resource obtained from it. Just like bees in there on the ranch, deposit buzz wax into a lamp's refinery where it can then be used for crafting science. Objects. Oh, okay. So I actually store everything in here quite nice, nicely actually so cool and give me that so that gives us that you guys are not done yet but you are no oh, don't come back you done I love how they do a little dance it's like I'm done here and so we've got a lot of uh, oil there which is actually really really good anything around here no we do need to go and make more of these guys actually right. Right, can I make anything can I make them no. <laughs> Not at all. Warp tech though? No, we need deep brain. We got one hexacomb, but we need a strange diamond. Slime fossil, I don't know where I'm getting that from. This is doable. Wild honey. Hydro turret, nearly. We need deep brain as well, so let's get these guys. Come here. Any plorts? Guys, you get plorts? Oh no, we don't have any plorts. Alright, well, we can always just kind of tag these out and put that there. That uh, there. Is that a way to snow? Let's grab all these just now. Give it. There we go. You still need it? Yeah, it's still growing. Hey, you, don't worry. You guys are going a dozen. You, you just have 12 minutes left. That's actually really, really cool that we can actually make them. So these have 22 minutes left. That's... So we do, like, we know how to kind of make them. Warp teleport would be kind of cool. Deep brain, I believe that's probably going to be, like, in another area. 
Because we got like a lot of that from this here, but we didn't get any slime fossil or lava dust. So we're gonna need to get as many of these guys as we can. I'm gonna pick up a lot of pink plorts and we're just gonna put these things everywhere. Actually, let's check what Enchilin needs because I believe it's not just pink plorts. There's other things you need as well. Then have a little look see. Okay, what do we need? Rock plorts and rad plorts. So we have enough of rad plorts, but we need some more rock plorts. Uh, tabby plorts, boom plorts, right? So, and uh, this needs. Right, so, we need more tabby. In, no, we don't need more tabby, probably. We need more rock. Which one of our lovely places. Oh, look at me that. Put that in. I feel like bringing back the pink rock plort, the pink rock slime, is probably a good idea right about now because it use, those things actually use that a lot. I mean, we do have this guy down here, which actually gives us tabby and rock. Really Don't bring that bloody radiation my way, buddies. Right, let's see. There is... Okay, there's a lot of hunter plorch. And you have nine of them. I want to go out and see if we can get more pink plorch, So and We have 16 rock. There we go, lots of pink slimes out here. You guys are all chowing down, excellent. I just need the plorts, just give me the plorts. That's all the plorts in. Got more plorts up here, excellent. You guys don't look too happy. Lots of plorts, plorts, plorts. I don't think I've said plorts so much in my life. It's just, it's, it's so exciting to actually be able to do this, but we need these guys. Hello, guy. Okay, wait, ow. What did this do? What did this feed you? Don't know what I just gave you, but anyway. Give me that, and that, and that. More over here. Plenty. The good thing with the pink ones, though, is you can actually find a huge amount of them out in the wilderness. Yeah, there we go. We do have quite a little bit of a chunk there, so let's go... Uh, ow. Not get hit in the face. Let's go back and see if we can actually get this stuff then. So it'll be pretty damn exciting to see what we can actually do once we start to actually get these more across the board. There was two placed out further away, further out, so that's something to consider. Can I actually get any upgrades at all? What? Treasure cracker? What? Allows you to bypass the locks on basic treasure pods. There's treasure pods? What? I believe the hunter plot should actually be sold. Since it gives us... Oh, that's went down actually. The crystal one on the other hand is giving a huge amount. Yeah, give me that. There we go. Just give us a little bit of cash, but we always know that we can actually get a lot from it. Let's go around and put these guys in and get some stuff out and put it across the board. Probably put a lot in here. But I mean, it's probably better to try and see what other areas gives us. Maybe you want to put them in the machine first. Voila! Right, okay, what goodies can we get? Right, we want some of these. One of these, one of these, one of these, one of these. Don't have enough pink plorts. Right, so that's going to get siphon underground resources, drill for buried materials. more pink ports but you know what let's go and see what we can find that's gonna just take us down that way there's no teleporter up here which is a bit of a shame how long till these guys are done eight minutes yeah eight and a bit minutes don't know whether putting more around here is probably worth it or we just uh, let's just bring up this menu so we can see where we can actually put some you put some out here i know that so we've got a blue glue which is actually pretty cool but we do have some that are in the other areas. We could put some in this sort of extended island. Not entirely sure that would be worth it or not. 
Eventually, it's going to come to the point you'll forget about these, and you'll be like, well, where the hell did I put them? Uh, there is that area down there. I don't know if it's worth it putting anything in here or not. So this is like a little area now. Which is cool. It's nice to see things expanded. Just, you know, just have a little area. You can gather some materials and everything. Put one over there. You could put one over there. That's intriguing. Put one here. One here. Ow. Right, we want to kind of put some in here. These guys are no, no, they're still angry. Still angry, never mind. We did put two out here. Which I don't think are near done yet. Uh, about three minutes, three, four minutes. Not bad, not bad. And we want to put... Let's go this way. And through here. Wanted to get in here. See what this gives us. Not actually sure this actually does anything, but you never know. Wait, that actually tells us what. Oh dear. Didn't want to do that. Didn't want to do that. Do they work? Like, do they. No. It's... Yes. Basic 22 minutes. Got going on. Could actually siphon a lot in here. But I want to try and go to a bit where the crystals all are. Here probably give us something, but there's a bit up there, isn't there? Just recover some. What are these guys? These guys are probably the best, though. I think because they just sit there and chill. It's like, hi, how you doing? There we go. I want to go in here. So I believe you'll probably find some lava stuff in here. Nope. Still. Don't know how chickens are surviving in here, but anyway. You'll do that. We have one more that we can use. Is there any more blue in here? I think there is, actually. Nope, there we go. I get it stuck. There we go, right? Put that in. There we go. Just to see what type of things we actually get. Stop hitting me, guys. Seriously, it hurts. But they do have 22 minutes, so obviously there's all these materials, and you get a little steed, you get a little med pit pack, you go up. Probably what you could do is put something like a teleport there, and to the base, which would be good to obviously, if you go back and find the materials you need out there, go back and just grab them. Anyway, let's jump down here. It's gonna casually pass through the radiation, and what the hell hit me? There's a rock out there. Fine, fair enough. Noted. That hurt. A lot. Right, let's go through here, and um, we do have these ones in here, which I believe we'll probably... Because there was some stuff that we haven't, like, got. Like, obviously, is whatever this is. We did get that, and we did get that, and we did get that, and the hexacomb, but there is the other ones that we didn't get. I don't think they say where you actually, like... Does it say, actually, where you get them? Just one is common resource obtained with a drill. It's comes an uncommon resource obtained with an appearer. Okay, so you probably get like one per one of those, I think. Uh, common resource obtained. It's an uncommon resource obtained for a pump. And a common resource. So you just have the, the common and the uncommon. So it's kind of like basically hit or miss. Hello, you guys. Hello. Don't at, hit me. Ow. That really damn bloody hurts. Give me all this. Eat them. No? Don't want to eat them? No? Okay, fine. Be that way. Can't remember the way out, but anyway. Ah, there you two are. I think these are actually nearly done. Yeah, they are. Let's see what we actually get from these guys. There's also a boss. Not a boss. Where are you? Where are they? I hear them, but I don't see them. Oh god! There you go, guys. You're all safe now. Don't worry. If you could all stop eating each other's plorts, that might be a good idea, just so you know. Where the hell did I get? Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. I saved your life. You hit me in the face. 
So very kind of you. These guys are literally almost done, so we'll soon see what they're actually getting for them, which is actually pretty damn cool. I love how you even see the little word chomp come up when they, like, just very comically, just like, like comic book style going on. Let's see what these guys do when you actually done. So they're actually drilling away. I wonder if you can replace the drill, like, like if you, ow, what the hell, shoo, <laughs> oh, oh, does a little dance, oh, now can I place one back there, you can, that is, heavy metal export experts often call this hard rock deep purple, interesting. Primordial oil. Excellent. So we got some jelly stone there as well, but in, so that is definitely where you're going to find the endogonidium. I don't know if I'm even pronouncing that right. It's definitely an area you obviously build up as like, you're going along. Get teleporters to certain areas so you can just nip out, place them down, nip back and so on and so forth. So you can actually start getting them drilling as quickly as possible. I don't know if five of them are going to be enough to build anything, but never know. Obviously, we can't see the blueprints until we're actually there, so we'll take it from there and see what happens. I don't think the other ones are going to be done, but I think what we'll do is a. Oh, hello. What is this? Still don't know why it's building carrots, but anyway, building, making, growing, that thing. There you go, buddies. Right, let's see. So we have this. Don't think you can actually sell those or anything. Let's see. Curious. Uh, which one uses that? That uses that. And you need actually eight and eight spiral streams. All right. Uh, royal jelly. Where the hell am I going to find royal jelly? I don't know. This. Nowhere near it. This. We do have a lot of primordial oil. So this is nearly there. Hydro turret. Deep brin. Don't know where I'm getting that from. How's these guys doing? 11 minutes. Guys, there is so much to explore in Slime Rancher. There's so much to do. There's a lot of goodies you can actually find. These things are adding just a whole new layer to the game already when there's already so much to do. And you have a bit of fun. Anyway, thank you very much for watching this. There may or may not be another episode of Slime Rancher. It really depends on when the next update is and really depends what kind of happens for these guys. These actually are almost done, so what I might do is kind of wait for these to be done. See if we can make anything. If not, I will call it there. But... Let's have a little look. So, I think that... Does that pause time? No, oh, it doesn't. I don't think there's any more blueprints to unlock, though. No, not at all. I like it how this looks. So, this actually looks cool. Oh, how cool is this? It's a little... It's actually like the robots, but in white. That's cool. Can I go over here? Some crystal over here, and bits and bobs. What's over here? Can I, can I, can I hide in here? I love how there's this. This is cool. You should. No, you don't. You're nowhere near done. The moon! Let's see. These guys, I think, are the ones that were almost done. Yeah, 55 seconds, 55, 55. Excellent. See so we can get to them. May as well go back and nip those carrots up and so we can actually use them. It would be nice if you could get some sort of personal assistant to go around feeding everything. Would be kind of cool. Although it probably could, like, if you shifted, or because that's why we put, uh, literally it's all food that's through there. And then we have these guys and then these guys in the cave. It's just kind of like, what do you kind of do, really? Uh, let's see. You guys are all happy. Well, I'm just going to make sure they get some ca put carrots in. There you go, you can be fed now. Oh, nearly done. I like how they kind of stop and then they do the little, they kind of stop, work things out, and then do a little dance. It's like, yes. There you go, little guys. Yous are not having fun in there, are yous? Oh, really? There we go. Activate. Wait a minute, is that slime fossil? Oh, excellent. And we got some spiral stream there. Well, that didn't work. So you can pretty much get them all mostly apart from that Indonesian thing. Indonium or whatever the hell it was. So each one of them does give you a hexacomb, so you need six of them. 
It doesn't really tell you because it doesn't at the moment. Obviously, this is open up. It doesn't actually tell you what the buzz wax is used for. But hexacombs, you need five of these. A strange diamond, whatever the hell that's going to be. I get the feeling that lava dust is going to be in where we've actually put some of them. So that'll be good if we can actually get our award. Pink Warp Depot, a set of two gadgets that allow you to remotely transfer resources between two points. So that means you could go to somewhere, place this one down, and fire through your resources till the other area. This allows you to actually physically teleport. Which would be really good. So you could probably piss some ET each other. But yeah guys, I'm going to leave it there for today. Thank you very much for watching Slime Ranger. See you all next time. <laughs>